Let me teach you a game called Cross the River. Again, this is a two-person game. One person sits on this side, another person sits on the other side, and they um, each of you get five pennies, and you want to put them anywhere you want on this number line here, I've, um, one through 12. And you can put your pennies, just kind of set a penny somewhere, and then the other person does it too, and they can put them wherever they want to, just over a number. Okay, put them wherever you want to. And then you get two dice. And now what you're going to do with the two dice is you're going to roll the dice. So let's say it's this person's turn. They're going to roll the dice, and you want to take the sum of the two numbers. So five, six, seven. So I'm going to go to seven on my side, and if I have a penny there, I'm going to slide it across the river, right? And then um, the other person's going to go. Now the goal of this one is to win, you want to have the least number of pennies on your side. So I'm going to go to the other side, okay? And, and the other person's going to go six, seven, eight. Okay, there's no pennies on eight. So they kind of like lose a turn, all right? Let's say they rolled a nine, okay? And this nine comes over and it just stacks on top of this one. That's a situation that can happen. And then let's say this side rolls a nine, then both pennies go across, all right? And basically you're just trying to get um, as many pennies across the river as possible. So be smart about where you put your pennies. Now what you wanna do it is you wanna do, um, you wanna do five rolls per person and see who has the most pennies after that or you can do 10 rolls. Uh, really, you can do as many as you want, but that's how the game is kinda done. So good luck. Again, look for strategies.